going on guys welcome back to Americana we recently picked up a 69 Mercury Cougar SS sports special it was sitting in the back of a semi trailer for like 20 years the guy bought it back in like 72 he was the second owner he used to take it to car shows and stuff um, it's a pretty cool car we're gonna see if we can get it up and run it and maybe drive it around the block all right enough listening to me talk about it let's check out this Cougar all right guys so this is a 69 Mercury Cougar SS, which is a sports special. It was a one-year deal. It's it's a trim package. It gets those sweet little rocker moldings. It gets a racing mirror. It still comes with whatever engine you wanted. This one's got a 351 in it, which you know isn't the best, but it's definitely not the worst. So we'll see if it, see if we can get it running. It's been well taken care of, I think. Oh, I'll put this giant battery in here. It's got the go handle. Yeah, I made that up. I know, it's pretty good. Pretty good joke. I just want to see if it'll show me how much fuel is in it. So I can see how much fuel, basically, I need to get rid of. It's really clean. Headline is really solid. You got some sweet custom speakers. You better believe it. I mean, it's super solid, obviously. I mean, the seats, these seats don't have tears in them or nothing. I guess a little animal got in here and started ravaging he, he tore up a little seat a little bit oh and then but besides that dude solid little horn beep beep does it work no Ooh. all right let's see got it in neutral or driver it's in park okay the fuel gauge shows empty but does it yeah I don't like that. Like maybe it's really empty. I don't know. Turn it over. See what's off. Let it roll over? Yeah. Oh, she's definitely like ready to rock. Um, let's just go over to the fuel pump and put five, you know, five, six gallons in it. See what's up. All right, let's do the jump box on this bad boy. See what she's got in store for us. I just want to see these headlight covers flip down. When she starts up, as you know, they're vacuum operated. Look at this like giant, like the vacuum thing for them. Like, just like way over, overbuilt. Like, they weigh like 14 pounds each. Yep. All right, hold up. Get a little gas in there. Hold on. I'm trying to just get it to pull some fuel from the tank. She's getting oil pressure. Good oil pressure according to this little gauge. Oh, I get it one. It's probably definitely gone through at some point. I can smell fuel. Can you? Yeah. Okay. I guess this is a little particulate filter. Yep. 
I smell it, don't you? I feel like there's gonna be a bunch in here. I feel like it's just gonna come pouring out. Yeah. Oh, I guess not. It's a big no. Yup. <laughs> hold it, hold it, hold it. Yep, just started shooting right there. Well, was that the first time it actually shot fuel? I don't know. You this know? carburetor just doubles as a wrench. So if there's fuel in there, it should come pouring out of here, right? Because it's a little check ball. Technically. <sighs> yeah, it's just a filter. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, maybe this is the first time she actually... Dude, it was just like one little squirt. I wonder if our fuel pump is Either it's or it's... Oh, that's convenient. Here's the fuel line right here. There's fuel in here. Fuel in what? The outlet or the inlet? In the, in the inlet. Like that hose is full, so yeah, maybe our pump's shot. It's, it's either the pump is bad or it's like not getting... It's almost like the, the pickup tube inside the tank. I guess it doesn't matter, does it? I'll see if I can hear something. No, I don't really hear anything. Looks like this thing pops right out through the top. That would mean that the hoses have to be accessible from underneath there because it's not like a through the top type of thing. I can see the hoses down there. Can you? Yeah. You can see them you said? Yeah. There's well, only one. And it's right there in the front basically on the bottom. Of course. Okay, okay so that line has got some, probably just some old fuel in it. But this one here is obviously the f***ing culprit. Alright, so we have fuels to the we have, we have fuel from the fuel line, and then we don't have fuel coming out of this guy. It's just like little spurts. So at the tank, the filter thing sock is probably plugged. So I think the fuel pump does work. So if we disconnect this, I can suck fuel through this. But the way it is now connected, you can't, you can't get any flow. So we're busting the back apart so we can like see if we can unplug her. Oh, dude, it's gummy, dude. Yeah, it's like gum. That's that's nasty. Yeah. Put a rag and blow up from this side and build like you know maybe half of the inside. Right. Actually, you know. Um. Yeah, I mean, if I could tap on right there, you know. You try these. Oh, <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> All the clampage. Did it turn? Oh, it did. I think. Yeah. She had no choice. <laughs> <laughs> Should I see if we have a? a Brass barb. That's what we're gonna need. <laughs> and then we'll just tie okay. it on. Let me see if we have one. Is it, yep. is it, is it actually threading? Yep. Dude.
right, turn it again. You don't need to put your finger on the end of the hose. You feel it like pumping. Really? Maybe not. Yeah, you hear that? Yeah. Sounds like squirter yeah. action. She's finally running. Oh. Yeah, I got my foot on the gas a little bit. <laughs> Did it backfire at the carb? Yeah, hang on. All right. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it works right either. It's like, yeah, it's right out the bottom, dude. It's just draining out. Maybe we can just yeah. tighten those guys. Maybe we can get lucky. It's gonna. We're gonna have to take the carb apart and you know, rebuild it. It's running mostly off fuel, I think. Maybe it just needs a little adjustment then. Just call me the carburetor. The carburetor tuning king. It's hard to get that good gas in it. Well, there you have it. I think the accelerator pump is pretty well useless right now. So I bet if I give it gas, it'll just die. Right. Purrs like a kitten. That's a 351. Oh, <laughs> they're so slow. <laughs> it sounds good. The turn signals on these are supposed to go, are supposed to be sequential. One, two, three, one, two, three. The flasher is messed up. I don't know. It's probably a complex. Too cool, man. It really, it runs good. It runs like a champ, man. And the flip up headlights are freaking sweet. I mean, hold up, let's get the full effect. Oh, probably about 20 years she's been sitting in that trailer. She's come back to life.
absolutely purrs. So it just took some time to get that fuel work through the carb and the accelerator pump's not in the best condition, but it is functioning now. She's just been sitting a long time and that, that gas, the gas tank pickup was just plugged. No surprise there really, seeing that before. Yeah, running good. I mean, I'm impressed. She does have no brakes. What's new, you know? Think we should give her some brakes? Yeah. Well, should we just see if we can just drop fluid in it? Yeah, I'm sure we can. It's just gonna be just fine. It's gonna be like, you know what? All I need is a little fluid, guys. Yeah, she's uh. I'll, I'll pressure ride them. She's dry. No, it okay. doesn't look like it's full. See if we can get some brakes. I don't know. Oh. I feel a gentle bit of back pressure. Yeah, it's oh dude, it's it's growing up there like crazy. Do I hear it hitting the ground yet? Oh dude, it's just like easy, easy, easy. What's going on? Looks like shooting up like a six foot mountain. Okay, dude, there is something there now. Now I'm pushing fluid. Oh! oh. Dude, it's hitting a wall. Oh. Okay, hold up, hold up. I gotta refill that back one. I gotta refill the back one. She took it all. Dude, no. <laughs> this thing has brakes. I will be mind blown. I mean, they're... Oh, I don't know if... What? Oh, no, it's... I don't know if they're actual brakes, though. They, they're like kind of running into a wall. And then I'm kind of like pushing. Oh no, she's, you can feel the piston I had to like push. Oh, she's, popping she's up. doing weird things. Like right there's a wall. See that? Did you see that? Yeah. She just needs to bled out. Now it feels really good. All right, I'm gonna try to start it. Oh, the brakes definitely. So like now they're, there's a leak somewhere I think. They're built up again, but wow, like it never, never stopped. All right, I'm going to try drive. I just put it in drive and nothing happened. All right, we're going to drop in some ATF. Are the brakes leaking? Awesome. Yeah, because the brakes weren't really doing anything. All right, so we did get the trans working. It goes into gear and I'm sure it works fine, but we saw what we thought was a brake leak, but it's not really a brake leak. It's just leaking fuel, probably out of the fuel pump. So we might slap a new fuel pump on there. Or we might just leave it for now. All right, guys. Well, we just threw a new fuel pump here on the Cougar. It runs good. It doesn't leak anymore, but You got brakes? I don't think you really have brakes. Kind of have them or not really? Oh, they're like f f up. Well, there they are. Just need a little pumping up. Probably a little going around the block. I don't know. They're, they're weird. Are they kind of dragging? Yeah, they're like, yeah, they're like dragging and like not dragging and like I had to push my foot past like a like a detent to Yeah. God she sounds great. I mean wow, that's pretty impressive. Cougar Maiden voyage. She's out here just rolling around like a champion. Oh yeah. Okay, Jesus, my neck. <laughs> She's got me. 
medium brakes. Yeah, she's got some brakes going on. Give us some radio. Let's see how it let's see how it was back in 69. Well I was kind of right, but I said it the wrong way thing. And now that the two week suspension is coming well, out, you said yeah. no all right, thanks for watching, guys. Um, tell me what you think down in the comments of the 69 Cougar here. Make sure you go down and hit that like button. Subscribe for me. If you're not subscribed, I appreciate it. This is Lars Americana. Peace. Oh, yeah, the bill sheet could be under that crap, you know? It's a problem. Yeah, dude. Huh? Bottle of Swolgen. Slow berry liquor stuff. Check that out. Oh, <laughs> whoa. All right, first thing that came out was a cup. Can you say you have a build sheet? There is a build sheet right there. This is a Ford cup, dude. Yeah. Nice. Oh, we can see some stuff. Well, look, what if you hold it over here? Oh, like an x-ray thing. Ha, 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 ha.